What you're about to see is a peeping Kenny boy montage of footage. He knows where my camera is though, but you'll see that he comes into my land. Now this is an easement through my wooded property. My wooded lot comes across here. This is my wooded lot. This is my wooded lot. All the way to the back of our red shed is my wooded property. So this is an easement. So this is my property. And this is what he does. And uh, I have repeatedly tried to get him trespassed off my property for doing this. And I'm going to start putting it up for you the public to see and uh, there I'm not going to show my cameras but he uh, clearly then was back on the road as well passing my camera here is one of his fun little stunts in earlier in the summer ripping a trench in my yard and uh, my camera of course didn't catch that but that'll be changed here by the time this video is up uh, it'll be changed. I don't talk about stuff until after it's fixed. Here you can see he is widening the road. And I'm pretty sure that shows on camera. He's been widening the road by many feet throughout the past months. Here you can see on the video montage to come, he was running over here widening the road this way for quite a while and you can see how far out he was running and that shows up in the videos you will see that his tire was about here his outer tire and his inner tire was always right about here and I'm just gonna start showing stuff from now on until people start moving and taking care of things and fixing things and here was another fun little stunt in the summer digging holes in my yard again knowing where my camera was at the time here's another quite recent one now there's nobody else down here so hey, there's nobody he's not passing anybody this is just tearing up my land over here he's been back and forth through here quite often way up you can see a line right there in the grass he digs in just, just tears it up. Just to antagonize me. Here he's been cutting and mowing the lawn um, where he visits and stays deep into my property on this side. And uh, I don't want to go over in front of the house right now in case there's somebody there. But he uh, has a well-maintained path out there. And he actually called the police on me for being in my own property doing that one day you'll notice conspicuously the no trespassing sign is missing again but you can't take off the purple paint one last thing again just note that you'll see his tires are over here in most of the previous of the photos that I'm sharing this is from a, a last month and I am sharing last month's photos because I changed my security around from time to time and I don't mind sharing with you things from older times. So you can see it's recovered some and lifting back up but you can clearly see in most of the photos that the vehicle tire was in here and the outer tire was in here on that whole entire month and you can see that how it's been you know widened out and he'll be back to that again Guaranteed. You can see here how deep into my land he goes. If he could go further past the telephone pole without hitting a tree or something, he probably would. But uh, this is what he does. So I will share the photos with you, and hopefully one day somebody will do something about this to put an end to it, because I'm tired of it, and uh, I've got evidence galore. Up here at the entrance to my wooded lot, the end of the road used to actually go through this little grassy point. That was the end of the road. And he has widened it that far. Well, you can see the line of the road and how far he has widened it into my woods. 
This is a long way cut into my woods and this way. This used to be the road. This used to be where people came and turned, right here. And he's widened it deep into my woods over here and deep into my front lot over here. Well, still my wooded lot, sorry. But you can see how deep that is widened out. And that's where it used to be, just to antagonize me. And if he could go further and not hit that tree, he probably would. It's not much farther he can go without hitting trees now. And I think that's the only limiting factor at this point is just not hitting the trees and clipping it with a mirror. If they weren't there, he'd be way out over here if he could. Guaranteed. Actually, you can see he has come in. Just, just that little bit extra to just because he can get in there between this tree and this tree. See that? How he's curved out deep into my lot. Just because he can. Here's a very clear and quite recent tire track deep into my wooded lot. And so the idea today is I'm going to show you just a few photos of peeping can coming by. And this is not all of them in a given month. Just a few photos of him coming by. And uh, just to show you how often he comes by and with how many different vehicles he comes by. Just to stare at my family and often record my wife and daughter playing in the yard. So, here we go. So, just a disclaimer for YouTube. Uh, this is my land all the way through here. This is my wooded property. There is an easement through my wooded property, but the photos you're about to see are of a person who has clearly been told to stay off my land he has been coming on my land in front of my cameras and against my will again and again and again. So this is just evidence for police of someone on my land in front of my cameras on my property when he has been told repeatedly to stay off.